The Infectious Diseases Society of America Foundation is proud to highlight the contributions of women in the field of ID. Women have long faced historic inequities, ranging from obstacles in medical and academic settings to their discoveries often being attributed to male colleagues. No longer in the shadows of history, we salute the female researchers who weren't deterred and instead broke boundaries that reshaped and advanced the study of infectious diseases. The pioneers who paved the way for modern researchers, like biochemist Catalin Carrico, who co-discovered an essential component of mRNA technology that laid the groundwork for the COVID-19 vaccine that later Dr. Kizmikia Corbett helped design in 2020. These types of technologies have been in development for a very long time. I was really happy when people wrote me emails and said that uh, they could see their parents. We applaud countless women in public health, research, academics, and private practice, whose leadership and advancements have improved the health of millions. One of the most memorable parts of my infectious diseases career has been seeing the progress of HIV AIDS. As an infectious disease specialist in a state with areas that have limited access to important health care, telehealth is enormously important to my patients and my practice. The work that we engage in is both rewarding and impactful. We all can do our part to create pathways to recruit and cultivate the next generation of women ID professionals. As a woman leader, I want to keep supporting our future leaders who are coming from diverse backgrounds. We must continue to promote diversity and equity for all entering our field. My message for women and for vaccinologists is never, never give up in the face of irrational resistance. Please join us honoring women in the field of infectious diseases. Visit idsafoundation.org to learn more.